flying being delayed. There's something wrong with the aircraft. They have to maintain it. It's like 7.30. Um, it's almost about another minute. Unfortunately, our flying delays like about an hour. <laughs> so we're just gonna go to the restaurant to find some eat, maybe uh, just stay there chilling for three hours and then come back. Hopefully, it's no more delayed though. Our flight supposed to be 3.58, so it's delayed to 4.08. So 4.00 and then 4.28 and then 6.08 and right now it's 6.20. There's something wrong with the aircraft, they have to maintain it. Um, and they don't know how long it's going to take, could be an hour, could be two hours, four hours. Or maybe the flight is going to cancel. So, so far we are about seven hours in. Um, so sitting at the airport. Alright guys, so welcome back. Um, so at this point, the flight is still delayed. So there was a lot of arguments at the counter because the uh, Frontier agents, they, they didn't know what happened. They wasn't clear what's going on with the flight. There's, they, they keep saying, okay, the aircraft need to, need to be maintained and it's gonna take probably an hour, two hours, even four hours. They don't know yet. Yeah. There was just the announcements. Flight canceled from uh, from uh, Punta Cana to Miami flight. Our flight from Orlando, uh, from Punta Cana to Orlando. Um, <laughs> I don't want it to be canceled. To be honest. Hey guys, so unfortunately the flight canceled. And the thing is, we have to book a hotel for ourselves. We have to pay for it. I'm not sure if we're gonna get a refund back or not. Um, but right now we're heading to get our luggage. We're gonna um, go to try to find a hotel and stay there for tonight. And tomorrow morning, we're gonna come back at 6 a.m. in the morning to check in. The flight is at 9 a.m. <laughs> Man, this is this is unbelievable. All right, guys. So I just took a showers. Um, we already checked in the uh, Marriott. I think it's called the four point four point of um. Scenario, scenario, or something. All right, guys. So this is the entrance. People think I'm crazy. It's like, I right, obviously have to whisper because it's late. So this is the room for tonight. This is the entrance. Going in. Um, you have to have a card to uh, entry. Okay. That's a lock. All right, to the right from the door, that's gonna be a car insert to keep all the lights on. And then from there, uh, on your right hand side, hello, let me turn on the light. <laughs> hey, okay. very nice, very nice hotel. So this room is like um, a, single, a single sink, nice and big mirrors, puts all the uh, dim lights around, very modern look. To your left, uh, standard, standard shower. The room comes with shampoo, conditioners, and uh, a body wash. Very nice. The water temperatures, it can get to very hot. So it's just perfect. <laughs> Whew, just took a shower, feel much better, man. It's been like, I don't know. <laughs> We've been at like we're at the airport since 12:45, um, and then we wait at the airport until like 8:30. Actually, almost night, almost night p.m. at night. So that's uh, that's when the um, Frontier announced that the flight is going to, it's going to cancel. I think we booked the hotel around like 9:30. <laughs> we 
we make a reservation for the room first, and then we um, book the taxi, go straight to the to the hotel. It's about like five minutes, really close. All right, so this is a toilet, basic toilet. How you doing? How's the food? Yeah. I'm good. Okay. All right, so on your left hand side, that's gonna be a iron bar. Some stuff to hand um just to hang on your um, clothes. Of course, there's an irons right there. Very nice and modern closet. Ah, uh, safe box. And uh, what is that? Is an empty? Is it empty right here? A couple of uh, paper cup. And then you got this mirror. Uh, probably for makeup or something. I'm not sure. And um, a giant um, LCD TV. And that's I think that's the um that's a window. You can like rose steps cutting up and here's the um here's a bat we book a um a king bat very nice very nice and comfy as a light some decoration guys um it's another light probably for reading light and um it's, it's kind of good chilling or reading so far all right so this is what we order um, this is the uh, what we order from the bar downstairs. We have a I have a beef fajita with some rice, and my wife she got a grilled salmon with some veggie on the side. Ah, uh, those salmons are bomb, guys! You gotta try it. Ooh! All right, guys. So that was just a quick room tour, <laughs> and um, thing is happening to us right now. Um, after we eating, probably I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back go to sleep. We have to wake up at five because I think I will check in at six a.m. tomorrow. Um, so we gotta wake up, wake up at five, getting ready, check out at five thirty, and um, the the hotel will provide us a free shuttles to the airport. Gonna have my dinner and then after that, we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Finger cross, hopefully everything gonna be smooth tomorrow. Morning guys, so right now it's 5.40 a.m. in the morning. We are about to check out and then we're gonna catch the soto to the airport. Just check out. Um, now we're waiting for the soto. Um, we have about 15 minutes to go back to the airport to um, check in. Hopefully the TSA is not that crowded. Um, but the soto's uh, been gone since five. I don't know, hopefully it's not that late, but um, yeah. <laughs> uh, main thing is um, flies. The um, I think the fly is the night a.m. But we're not sure what time is the morning gonna be. But they said that the check in at six. So um, hopefully we don't fly early. Just uh, checking the uh, TSA, so we gotta take it to Orlando. But I think we might get into another problem because um, we only get one ticket from uh, from the Canada to Orlando, uh, but we don't have the second ticket from Orlando to Baltimore. I talked to the guys that um, so we talked yesterday, so I saw him today, and he asked me like, how many tickets do we get? We only get one. But um, he got two tickets, so he already had the second, second ticket already, which is flying from Orlando to Baltimore. But the fly is on Saturday, which is tomorrow. <laughs> I don't know what to do, but we only have one ticket. Uh, so the plan is just gonna, <laughs> we need to go back to the US first, get our luggage, and then from there, we're gonna try to figure it out <laughs> later. Okay, so finally, we made it to the point. <laughs> Alright, so um, boarding starts at 8 30, and right now it's 8 50. I think we're gonna start to uh, depart throughout the night.
55, so which is good. <laughs> yeah, we make it back to the US. <laughs> Alright guys, so right now I'm at the uh, Orlando airport. We go to the customer service, trying to um, um, change the flight. Luckily we booked the flight, flying tonight, which is Friday, from 12, um, from 10, 10, 15. And we're gonna arrive at Baltimore around like 12, 12.48 uh, at night. Um, check in at 7.30. Hopefully, finger cross, man. And then for now we're waiting for our Uber to uh, come pick, pick that up and, and drive to a, a Vietnamese restaurant. make it to the Vietnamese restaurant. It's called Neil's Asian Kitchen Boba Tea. <laughs> it's my first time, it's our first time here. So um, I got the Neil's combination pho. Serve it's really nice. I love the guy, man. It's funny. Alright guys, so we just finished um, eating lunch. We have about, I guess, three hours. <laughs> um, we're thinking about go to the epic theater to watch a movie. Weather in Orlando is so good. Sunny, but windy. Uh, not too humid. Very nice. Hey right guys, so we just um, finished watching the movie Uncharted. So right now it's about 16. Gotta catch an Uber going back to the airport. And we'll fly, it's gonna be seven. Uh, I mean, let me check in 7.30. So we got some time left. Uh, hold on, not yet, not yet. So we make it back to the airport. Uh, about to check in. We are here a little bit early, 6:30. So our we'll flight at 7:30. Trying to check in early if we can. We just passed the TSA gate. Attention, all the oh, now we're on the way to we Gate 12, which is our flight from uh, from Orlando to Baltimore at 10:25, and it's on time. <laughs> Hopefully, it's no more delay though. <laughs> All right, guys. So right now it's about night um, nine fifty five. Um, the gate been changing from gate seventeen to gate twelve. Now gate fourteen. Still waiting. Um, not sure what time we're gonna board it. Start start to boarding. But the good thing is flight still on time, so that's a good thing. All right, guys. So we just boarding. Um, right now it's eleven o five. I mean, our flight is at 10.25 um, and then our flight delay until 10.45 and we're boarding now it's um, 11.05 Once we get to Baltimore, we have like another drive back to our house which is like um, one hour and then from there, um, I'm gonna pick up my cars I have to drive another 30 minutes to get to my house so in total, I don't know, in total, probably, hopefully, I'm gonna make it back to my house at 3 a.m. in the morning. Alright, 
so we'll make it back to Baltimore. <laughs> All right, so we're on the way to pick up our luggage, and this is it. Another hour drive, and now we're home. Home, split home. <laughs> Alright guys, so I just made it home. It's about 2.50 a.m. in the morning. So now we have another 30 minute drive. Alright guys, so I was working on my videos and I realized that the last part, I didn't end the videos because um, after we arrived to Baltimore Airport, I was that tired. So I forgot to end the video. So sorry about that guy. So today I'm going to end the video here. There's going to be one more part of the um, Punta Cana's series. Uh, we're just going to give you guys tips and hints for people who are planning to travel Dominican Republic, especially in Punta Cana Airport. You guys don't want to miss that. It's going to save you guys a lot and lots of times. Okay, so hit the like, share, hit the subscribe button. So you guys don't miss my videos. All right, for now, okay, signing out. I see us.